New at five families living in a third ward community say they do not want new development to change the feel of their neighborhood. The CUNY Homes community is on Trujillo Street at Alabama, and it was established in 1943 as Houston's first and largest public housing community. The concern centers around a recent grant. KBRC 2's Sabira Rafer joins us from the neighborhood today where the residents are laying out their concerns. Sabira. Well, Keith, when there's talks of revitalization, there's also a debate on how it should be done. Dolores Ford says she's seen her neighborhood change. All you have to do is go down one of these streets. You'll see new townhomes. You see new houses being built. She says CUNY Homes has remained a constant. I've been here long enough where I can say this is my neighborhood. This is where I live. This is where my children grew up. She wants to continue to call it home. I don't want to be priced out. But that doesn't mean she doesn't want any change. As far as the choice initiative, yes, I am all for it. In June of 2021, the Houston Housing Authority was awarded a $450,000 grant by the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development to come up with a neighborhood transformation plan. This is for the residents to be able to come out and say, look, we want this. The Houston Housing Authority says the goal is to work with community partners on how to leverage public and private funds to transform the community. The challenge is the training for us to be able to really know what what the law says for us. Burdell Ingram lives here. She says every resident deserves to be a part of each step of the process. They do train it. That they do engagement, but it's only 60 to 90 minutes. So if it goes on and that, or you have more residents show up, it's always cut off. Wednesday afternoon, the founder of Can I Live, a national tenants rights organization, showed up to the CUNY community, encouraging the residents to question the process of these grants. That residents can actually organize, that they can create entities, they can create nonprofits. The Houston Housing Authority sent us the following statement in part, quote, Community groups, including the CUNY Homes Resident Council, have been directly involved in developing the transformation plan throughout the entire process, including monthly task force meetings and additional community events that further guide the agency's efforts in this initiative. NHHA says the goal is to create a mixed use environment focused on promoting safety and health initiatives. Reporting live in Third Ward, Sabir Rayford, KPRC 2 News.